think it's also just uh, important to give the Scottish context here. Oh, yes. that there is currently a bill going through the Scottish Parliament. Actually, the sponsor is my colleague, uh, Lee MacArthur, MSP, looking at assisted uh, dying. So um, if, and of course, the other thing important to remember is, is this is not something when it is debated in Parliament will be debated on party political lines. No, no. It will very much be yeah. a free vote. Absolutely. Yeah. But it yeah. does feel like um, the, the general public's position on this has shifted in recent years and certainly there's an expectation that the legislation uh, may pass in the Scottish Parliament. So um, we will potentially be in a position where one part of the UK has passed legislation in this regard and I think that is very, very important to note and all the things that Catherine has said in relation to um, the safeguardings will be part of that debate as well. What Catherine is talking about is those grey areas where Mm -hmm. it is much more complicated and that's actually what our role as parliamentarians is to consider the safeguards are there. There are obviously other parts of the world where assisted dialogue legislation is now in place Mm. and there are some parts of the world where there's concerns about whether there are necessary safeguards Mm. in place and Canada is an example of that. Uh, And that's that's why we need to be really careful. But this is part of a wider debate around death. I think we're really bad as a society about talking about it. Aren't we just, Um, yeah. uh, Plus in terms of looking at social care, end of uh, end of life, okay. but also dignity for disabled sure. people, 